back to my channel. So this is a collaboration between me and Cheryl Christine, who is an, a woman I adore and a woman I love. Like I really, really love her. I've been settled on any particular look, and I love these eyes. Like there, it's, it's not really defined. Like you can't really see the crease. It's just everything just kind of flows and blends in together. I will leave Cheryl's um, details in the description box. I'll also leave her um, YouTube name somewhere on the screen so that you can subscribe to her channel. She's amazing. I love the things she stands for and I love how open and how honest she is about the things that matter to her and the things that she actually stands for. So please subscribe to her channel. Show her some love. If you're not subscribed to me already, please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Would you wear this on Valentine's Day? Um, that's all I'll see you guys in the next video bye right now on my eyelid I have concealer and then I set my eyelid with the Ben Nye Topaz powder which is like a very good base for your eyeshadow especially if you don't have an eye primer I have an eye primer but I prefer this method so I'm going in with my NY jumbo pencil in milk and I'm going to put that on my eyelid so that it can really intensify my eyeshadow next I'm going in with that warm orangey brown type eyeshadow and i'm putting that i'm using that as my transition color next i'm going in with this orange which is in like a lighter shade of orange and i'm putting that in my crease i feel like i should have used this orange as a transition color but i don't know i was just trying to pack all the oranges i could find so i'm putting that in my crease and now i'm just going to blend it and blend and blend so that it really transitions nicely into the other color now I'm going in with that gold and I'm actually going to use that just so that it can give the main eyelid color a, you know, a boost. Palic orange type eyeshadow and it's from the BH Cosmetics 2nd edition palette. This eyeshadow was a bit powdery but I still try to work with it. I have to still go in with my finger just to press it in and just make sure that it comes out, you know, a lot more intensified. I was almost giving up on this eyeshadow because it just kept going all over the place and I really wasn't seeing it. So I'm also going to go in my mascara and I'm using the Maybelline Colossal Volume Mascara and then my lashes are Stag Lashes 737M and then Wispies. So now I'm going in with my NYX Rainbow Pencil on my lower eyelid and then I'm going in with that same orange metallic one and I'm just going to put that on my eyelid and I'm lining my waterline with the Kiss Beauty um, Gel Liner and then i'm also going to tight line i really love this eyeliner it's so so black so onto my face i'm just patting in my primer and i use the number seven beautifully matte primer now i've color color uh, you know i've color corrected and then i'm going to go in foundation like this is something you guys see all the time if you watch my videos but i'm just going to put you through it very quickly so i use the uh, mary k medium coverage foundation in 607 and i'm just going to I'm just going to really pat that into my skin with this brush. Um, I can't remember the name of the brush. I think it's Sedona. I'm not sure. So I'm going to highlight my face with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in Cafe. And I really like this. It gives me very toned down type highlight. So now I'm going to use the black opal foundation stick in black walnut to contour my face and then I'm just going to use a staple brush to blend the whole contour out. So I already set my face with the Ben Nye Topaz and Banana Powder and I'm going to use my face powder, that's the House of Tara um, powder palette. I'm going to use that to just blend out the setting powder and also to add some more coverage to my skin. So now I'm using the CoverGirl Ebony Bronzer to bronze my face and I'm using the same brush I use for my powder.
So now I'm going in with that deep plum blush from the BH Cosmetics Neutral and Blush Palette. And then I'm going to line my lips with this pencil from House of Tara. And I'm also going to go in with a liquid lipstick from Jordana. It's called Sweet, Sweet Masala Wine. And I'm just going to go over my lips with that. So I'm using the one of the highlighters from the Micelline and BH Cosmetics collaboration. I'm using the gold one to highlight the top of my cheekbones, my cupid's bow, the bridge of my nose. Um, yeah, and then I'm going to set my face with the Ellie Girl Matte Setting Spray, and that is the final look. Hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.